hi guys and welcome and or welcome back to my channel I am Raven and yeah so I um, am going to do an updated orbit wig video today um, duh which is why you clicked on the title right yeah yeah okay cool um so you guys let me tell you about this hair it's probably not the hair. I think it's me. I used some shampoo and I think that's what's causing the tangling. <laughs> this hair tangles. It tangles and it tangles and it tangles. I'm pretty sure it's me. So right now it is in its natural state. Um, this is what my Bigfoot has been running around. Um, but yeah, so this is the hair in its natural curly state. I decided to just put some conditioner on it and to let it air dry. I blow dried it a little bit because I didn't want it dripping all over the apartment because he's going to complain. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to just wear it in its natural state because when I straighten it, 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 it tangles so bad. And I know it's this shampoo only because... One, I've wind whipped hair before and it doesn't get tangly. Um, but I noticed that today when I washed it, as soon as I put the shampoo on it, the hair instantly tangled. I didn't have to touch it or anything. It just matted and dried up and clumped up and it was just a treacherous mess. But yeah, um, so then I tried to fix it with using some like Dove deep conditioner body wash because that's the only other thing I had and um, and I used some Hidden Shoulders which did, it helped a little bit but um, honestly the, the hair is still damp so it's still doing pretty good but I've noticed that the hair does better in its natural state than it does when it's straight and um, I'm gonna keep on wearing it and see what happens the hair is still soft it feels it's been feeling like from the beginning kind of sort of not like when I first bought it but after I wore it for a little while it started feeling kind of dry and brittle but I also had been using the same type of shampoo I've been using the matching conditioner but just a different fragrance um and so I think that brand is just not a good brand for this hair um I used it for my dreads which was great um, but it's probably just not a good brand and no, it's not a black brand or anything like that. So I'm going to switch out, um, my shampoo and conditioner and see how that goes. And then I'll give you guys another update on this hair. Uh, I'm going to keep on wearing it for a little bit longer, but I'm going to start just wearing it in its curly state. Um, but yeah, so the hair, the luster is still good. It still has a great shine to it. Um... The shedding is still there. It still sheds from the plucking and stuff like that. So I'm not sure exactly what that is about. But yeah. And then there's breakage as well. And because these hair strands are really, really fine. They're really, really fine. Um, but there is a little bit of breakage. And so I'm going to say that's probably the shedding. But I don't think this hair itself actually sheds. Um, let's see. We talked about the luster. Okay. So the hair, it was stiff for a little while. And even like, okay, so the day I conditioned it or co-washed it, it was fine. Because again, it was in its natural state. And then the minute I put the flat iron in it, I noticed that it had become like stiff. So yet yeah, it. And the curls weren't holding the same anymore. So um, I'm going to keep on experimenting with the hair and see if it's me, if it's the conditioner. Um, I'm sorry, but like as far as the wind whipping, it's going to happen to any hair. And I'm probably just going to go back to like cheapy beauty supply store hair and quick weaves for a little while. After this, um, we'll see. But yeah. So that's that. It's just a little bit damp right now. See, I got a tangle right there. 
Um, so I'm going to keep playing with it and see how it goes. And hopefully this video is probably going to be really, really short. But I'm not going to um, flat iron the hair because I pulled out my, flat, my good flat iron. And I was going to flat iron it. But that's what actually enticed me to wash the hair in the first place. Because when I, I co-washed the hair, I didn't put anything in it. So I'll leave my hair clean. And then I flat ironed my hair. And it became like that nasty like feeling. Um, and then, yeah. So then when I flat ironed it, I'm like, you know what? Maybe the hair is just dirty. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe that's why it's all stiff. Because I can deal with the tangling per se kind of sort of. And, um, yeah, so when I, when I washed it with the shampoo and stuff like that, I just told you guys what happened with that. I've got to do my baby's hairs because, bruh, like, this lace front is so dark that it just looks like, like the hair just starts right there. But there's actually, like, little hair follicles here that you really kind of can't see because the lace is so dark. So, I need to fix that. And I think I might glue it down again because I don't want the wig falling off. Um, so yeah, that's that. And I will keep you guys posted. Um, I will let you know the next time if I would buy this wig again. Um, after I change out my shampoos and stuff like that. Okay, so the hair is dry now, and as you can see, it's pretty big and bushy. Um, the back is tangled. See? What I was talking about. And, and my fingers will not get through that. There was a tangle. Oh, gosh. In the front, and that was... My fingers were able to get through it without having to do this. Oh, I'm doing the stink face right now. My bad. But yeah, so I just wanted you guys to see what I was talking about as far as the tangling. So technically it's still wearable. Um yeah, it's doing that nappy nape neck thing that a lot of hairs do. Uh, this is all tangled and uh, yeah so we will see what happens with this um, like I said I'm gonna keep wearing it just to see if I change my shampoos if that's gonna change anything with the hair um, I don't think it really looks tangly, but I'm not sure. <sighs> yeah. So I'm not sure if it looks tangled, but it is. It's a little bird's nest up in her. I need to stop playing with it before it gets bigger. I need to buy a different shampoo anyway because if that's what the shampoo does to this hair it's probably going to do that to all my hairs and I do need to go buy some different hair for when I take this down and do something else. Oh, I just turned my flat iron on. I think I'm going to curl the top of this. I didn't bring my brush in here and I don't own a comb still so I'm just gonna curl it how it is because I'm only curling this little section I think I need the cash on pronto nigga a lottery ticket I get the best of the bundle full of the white like it's Iggy Five million cash on wide low, and we bout to get it We from the north of the sand though, no name on my hitter Yeah, Freddy Krueger, give him a nightmare Soon as you close your eyes, nigga, we right there Yeah, Freddy Krueger, give him a nightmare What? Yeah, so That 
soft and the curls are awesomely amazing unfortunately the rest of the hair right now is not this is like probably the third segment of this recording i know in pre in the previous video i said that i was going to try and leave it in for like another couple weeks or a month or whatever but honestly i can't deal with this hair um so therefore i'm gonna take it out uh this hair has been in a ponytail for like two days and it i can't get my fingers through the back for some reason it's mainly this area right here and then going all the way down it just mats and tangles so so bad and honestly I really truly don't believe it's the hair I believe it was the shampoo that I used that screwed this hair up so um, sorry guys I couldn't give you like a real good in-depth review of this hair um, I'm gonna try and fix it uh, when I have some like spare time or whatever but as of right now it's not happening but yeah so this hair it looks it looks okay kinda sorta kinda sorta but the reality is this hair is not okay um it's super stiff it's not like it's still soft which is crazy but it's just really really stiff so if you brush it or something it's gonna stay however it is that you put it so yeah um so I'm gonna be taking this hair out and trying something different because this is not it this is not it so um, I hope this was okay for you guys. Uh, let me know your thoughts, your comments, or whatever the case may be. But this hair's got to go. <laughs> but it was fun while it lasted. Um, I'm kind of over it. And then two, like not only that, but I'm a little concerned because I'm scared of getting the whole like bleached front from the lace front since I am gluing it down. Um, since my combs aren't there, but yeah, so, I don't know, um, so I'm gonna do a quick weave next, uh, with some new hair that I just saw in the beauty supply store, um, it is model model yaki, yaki yaki, <laughs> but no, I'm gonna try this hair out and see how it goes, um, I will... See you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching and bye.